What's up? My name is Alexa Nicole and welcome back to my channel. If you guys are new to my channel, I am basically vlogging my weight loss, lifestyle change to better habits journey. It's fun. We're honest, there are struggles, there is a lot of emotional eating going on, it happens, it's, it's hard, but it's life and yeah, I'm just, I wanted to take you guys along with me in this journey. So I don't want to make this video extra long because it already is, so I'm just gonna jump right into it. Good morning guys, happy Monday, happy start of the week. My zits and I welcome you again to the channel because yesterday I kind of savagely attacked them and they have come out to play now. I'm ready to start this week in a very positive and different attitude. I am determined, unlike last week, that apparently last week I was determined at the beginning and then it kind of just went downhill, but I think last week was a hard week for me. It would have been amazing if I wouldn't have had any hard weeks at all during this journey, but I mean, I can't expect to just have great weeks all the time. I have put it behind me and I can move on to a great week. Oh my God, guys, we got these new pants and they're so cute. They've got like a sheen or a sparkle to them and they're white and I don't know, I'm in love with them. I'm gonna be adding some sprayable Pam butter. For my Metamucil. I do a big spoonful. And now I'm going to chug this whole thing down and after I'm done chugging it, I'm going to fill this whole thing up with water and chug it down as well. This is how they're looking. They smell amazing. And I'm almost done with this. This is what I mean when I say that it is chunky, you know? looks like a Gerber. Okay, and I just washed it and I'm filling it up with water because that last part was just horrible. Got my little mustard, a little bit of mayo. I've got my second cup of coffee of the day and I have got my glass of water. It is officially time for an update. I've been editing for so long. I took a shower. I feel super fresh and super clean. If you wanted to know, I added buttered spray pan thing. Okay, I've turned it around and here we go. I mean, it smells pretty darn good, so I'm excited. I'm also drinking a Sprite. No, <laughs> this is not a Sprite. I'm drinking a Coke Zero. Got my chicken. It smells pretty good. This meal plan is really weird and really crazy because I'm guessing that is what you guys are thinking. But. It only lasts for one week and I really want to give it a shot because I do believe in this meal plan and the process. If you guys want more information on that, I do talk about it a lot in my first two videos, like way, way, way back in 2017. I'm going to leave them linked down below. Let's give this a shot. I've got my ranch. This is the Hidden Valley, the original ranch because this is my favorite ranch. And I've got this one here in case I think it needs more. But it's good. I think I'm gonna make myself a cup of coffee as a pre-workout meal to go get them guns better because kind of are not that existent. Okay, I'm done. Quickly wanted to say that finally today I am feeling great again in my shell and just in my body and how I look. I don't know. I just wanted to give you a little like pan how I'm doing. Okay guys, we are done with the boxing lessons. Probably one of the hardest classes I think I've had in a while. Cause this trainer likes to like keep you jumping all the time and just like go fast and like punch the punching bag just like really quickly and everything. So like, ugh, I felt like I was out of breath. But I mean, I did the whole class. I kind of toned it down a little bit in certain parts and I didn't jump that much. But it was like, it was it was killer, guys. Anyways, right now we're going to the groceries. Good morning. 
morning guys happy tuesday oh my god my body hurts so much from yesterday's boxing class it was ridiculous it was just so intense guys okay plus i feel like my zits are finally healing up thank god i want to cut my hair so my hair is straight so i really want to get my hair done again like i don't want to cut the bangs again honestly because I've just found that they get in the way a lot and I like to have hair like laying around my face but not on it like that so they're just not for me I enjoyed them for a while but I don't think I'm gonna get them done again but I do want to add some texture to my hair I feel like it's really long and it's really boring like to have a straight cut like that so I'm gonna get long layers I don't know when I'm gonna do it but I think that with the color and like with the texture I think it's gonna be a lot more playful I'm gonna drink my little Metamucil mix and for this week I can't drink the grapefruit juice so it's just plain water and the Metamucil thing so let's let's get that done <laughs> Okay guys, it is already really late. I don't even know how it happened. It's already 2 p.m. And I'm barely having breakfast, or should I say, I'm having lunch. I know, it's a ton of ham, guys, but like I love, I love turkey breast, but I need some protein, I need some food in my body. I don't think I ate that much yesterday, and I felt really bad in boxing. And I know I'm not a breakfast person, but I'm gonna start eating. Uh, I'm just waiting for them to be like really well cooked because I do not like my egg whites watery at all. We've got our green salsa. Actually, this is not Herdes. This is the Monte Verde one, but I just emptied the little carton boxes into here because it's like a lot easier. I'm drinking a Diet Coke because I don't know guys, I'm just accepting the fact. I love drinking Diet Cokes. I mean, it's just a thing, it's not healthy really. I'm trying to change and little by little. Anyways, don't get discouraged guys. It takes time, but it gets better always. This is just basically my OG salad. So I'm gonna taste it on camera with you because this is a new dressing. Here we go. Like it's good, I can eat it, but it's just not the same as like the other dressings. I'm gonna have to work on it. I've been drinking water today, which is something I'm trying to implement as well as eating downstairs. I usually eat upstairs because I don't like eating alone. I mean, I like eating in front of the TV while the TV is keeping me company, but I've decided to stop eating upstairs. So yeah, this is a, this is an experience. Boots, keys, socks, and coffee in hand before I head out to boxing. By the way guys, I have this newfound appreciation for rice milk, like what the heck, it's so good. Whipped up a little stir fry for dinner. This is chicken with some spinach and some asparagus. Good morning guys, happy Wednesday. Oh my God, my whole body aches so much. Like, I don't know, I just feel all of me, like that it hurts. I don't know if I'm getting sick or I don't know if it was boxing yesterday, but I'm whipping myself up my cup of coffee right now because I just like, ugh, I just don't feel good. So guys, I did something completely different to normal. Instead of getting my coffee and going upstairs, even though I feel kind of meh, I decided to just whip up my breakfast. Maybe if I eat something, I'll start feeling better. First time I had it, it wasn't that bad, but now it's like, I don't know, I don't love it. <laughs> 
Okay, so I'm about to have lunch and I am debating if I want to have one of one of oh my god One of those or both of them last time I only had one piece of chicken and I felt like shit in boxing So I am thinking about having both of them Today because today is a weird day that I can only eat like protein and dressings so why not just have plenty of protein before a workout and get the muscle, get the gains. I'm also gonna be making some bacon and I'm gonna add some ranch to this. It's gonna be bomb. Okay, I, I've decided I'm gonna make both of them. I am in such a great mood today. A little fat bulging out, let's cover you up. I think we're gonna go super basic and we're gonna add salt and pepper to both of these. And I'm gonna butter my pan, guys. Oof. I love me some butter, and this is French butter, and I don't know why, but French butter is always better. I think I might have gone a little bit overboard with the butter, but I mean, it's gonna be buttery delicious. Can you hear that? It's beautiful. <laughs> Butter. I think I did go a little overboard. Look at that. Like my bacon is almost under water. Or well, under butter. Look at it glisten. Can you please? Yes. Oh yes. This is my favorite ranch. It's the Hidden Valley, the original ranch. And um, this is light. Everything here is just, yes. I am outside, ready to have my delicious meal, enjoying the beautiful weather, because we are having a really nice day today. I'm drinking a Diet Coke. This is the first of the day, so we, we are kind of proud. And it's like four something, guys just so you know. Okay guys, I'm on my way to my boxing classes right now and like always, I made my pre-workout coffee and guys, oh my god, I hated myself so much. I forgot to add Splenda and as you all know, I add two Splendas. So I like my coffee super sweet. So a couple of minutes ago, I took a big sip of this and ugh, ugh, I wanted to like spit it out but I was in the car so I had to swallow it. So I'm not drinking it anymore and I think I'm gonna drink it as a pre-workout drink after boxing. Probably gonna stop by a Starbucks and get some Splendas. Cause guys, that thing is nasty like that. Like seriously, like wow for the people that just drink like black coffee. Like wow guys, wow. Anyways, I'm gonna give it my all in the boxing cause I'm feeling, I'm feeling energized. I think the, the bad tasting coffee like really woke me up. <laughs> guys see the moon oh my god it was beautiful anyways guys boxing okay much better lighting the class was exhausting but it was great remember the coffee i never drank i just got home i'm gonna add two splendas and i'm gonna enjoy it now A difference. I added some ranch. Oh my god, I don't even know where to begin to explain how delicious this smells. <laughs> guys what's up I can't really raise my hand because I am in the car but it is Thursday I'm actually going with my mom to get her hair done but I definitely want to get someone to wash and blow dry my hair so that's why I'm wearing the the trusty hat and I also have my coffee to go and it is sweetened this time unlike the last time 
Sorry for like the super glary sun. Guys, so I actually got a cut. I cut it in layers. It's super bouncy, it's super cute. Still haven't done anything to my bangs because I am letting them grow out. So they're just kind of chilling there, but I feel, I feel great. My mom also got a haircut. Yay! It looks so good. Yes, I'm happy. Yeah. So guys, not only am I getting my nails done right now, my mom is so sweet. She's like, I'm gonna get you a massage. And I was like, oh my god, I love you. Guys, first of all, I got burnt when I was getting my upper lip wax, so that is ATMI. My nails, this was like a white with an iridescent sheen to it. I don't think you can tell in the camera, but mm, I am living for it. And guys, honestly, that burger today, mm, it's basically the only thing I've had, which is not great to only have one thing in your stomach, but guys, it was just so much and I couldn't even eat the whole burger. I had to take a patty out of it because it was just too much. This is not part of my meal plan, but honestly, I just felt so good today when I went and got my nails done. The ladies there have known me for like years and they were like, oh my god, what are you doing? Um, let us know, like I want to do your meal plan, please let me know like the contact and things like that. So it was just really nice to hear something like that. And I was like, I was getting my hair done, I was getting my nails done, I even got a massage, like I said, I was getting pampered. And I was like, why not just eat something that I want and have no regrets and guilt free? And I did, and I feel great. So yeah, let's keep it going. Got my coffee and I am ready for boxing. I am home, baby! Back from boxing, it was a great class. I am feeling so great. I am actually debating if to just having like a full cheat day since I've only eaten what I showed you a couple of hours ago. So they're too large, so we'll do one side first. Honestly, I wish I had like a more natural peanut butter, but this is the only thing we have in our fridge. Yum. This is actually a sugar-free jam. This is a blackberry flavor. Happy Friday! Okay guys, so yesterday I was supposed to upload a video, but honestly, I'm kind of just realizing that I set myself up to do something that I really want to do, but I'm just not in that frame of mind to be able to do it. And I don't want to let myself down and I don't want to let yourself down by telling you that it's going to come up when I just, like, I can't do it yet. I, I need to be ready. Yeah, I'm so sorry about that, honestly. It, like, infuriates me so much that I, I can't do it and saying that I can't, but I'm, like, I'm going to accept it. Sometimes you can't do things because you're just not ready for them. But don't worry, guys. Like, the weight loss journey is happening. I am vlogging it. I am going through everything. Oh my god, it's so hot and I hate the girl that burned me yesterday, like what is that? First, I had like zits all over. Now, I have a burnt upper lip. That's great. And yesterday, I forgot to take this, but I already took it because I really do want to see if this works. So far, I don't think it's working, but I think I'm gonna up my doses up to two spoonfuls a day because I mean, I'm not seeing results. My current setup, I've got my two eggs here, the ham I just cut up, some butter, some melted butter, and my little Johnsonville sausages that I love. Okay guys, food is ready to be served. I also added a little bit of that Dijonais to this. Mm, it smells heavenly. Got water. This is my second cup of these. And I've also got my cup of coffee. Mm. 
It's good today. I actually brought my computer downstairs. Close up. Okay guys, I wanted to talk about my Nike sport shirt. This is a large. This used to be so, so, so tight on my body. I hope I have a picture and if I do, I will put it right there. But look at that. Oh my god. It's the little things that just make your day. I don't think I've filmed myself crying. But I'm having such a terrible day, guys. Such a terrible day. And I thought I'd share it with you because normally when I have a terrible day, that's when I want to eat, like, just food and not care about my life or anything. But I want to be strong for myself even though I'm having such a terrible day with terrible people that I have to deal with because it's life and I can't take shelter and food so you guys if you're also having a bad day or you're crying um you can get through it too okay I'm actually going to the movies right now guys and I'm gonna eat popcorn it's gonna happen because it's been a day and we're okay with that guys I am terribly disappointed in myself I mean I know I was having a bad day, like I said a couple of clips back, but like yesterday was my cheat day, you know? And then today I just kind of went emotionally crazy and ate a huge popcorn on my own. It was half cheddar, half Takis, and I had an M&M small frappuccino. I said I wouldn't do it after that day because that day i ate because i felt good you know because i wanted to today it was more of a i'm angry so i need to it, like satisfy that emotion that's just going crazy and food has always been my comfort zone or my comfort thing and i fell for it again <laughs> and i'm kind of disappointed because I feel like I'm letting myself down and I'm like letting you guys down as well and it kind of just, ugh. Like I want to succeed so badly because I have ha like I have such high expectations of myself and ugh, it just drives me nuts. Anyways, my mom actually gifted me something from Massimo Duty. This is a big bag because she also bought her, like herself and my grandparents some things. But I wanted to show you because I don't think they're gonna fit me right now. They are super, super cute. They are a size eight or like 40 European. I'm gonna actually try them on for you guys so we can like see the before and after for when these actually fit me. And if they fit me today, I'm gonna be very surprised, especially like after this food baby, right? As you can see, I can't like get them up. <laughs> Like they're still all the way down here. I don't want to break them, so I'm not even gonna try anymore. But there is no, no way in the world that this fits me. <sighs> yeah, Ugh, they were so cute. Anyways, guys, I think I'm gonna end like the actual vlogging portion of everything because obviously I also didn't go to boxing today, but I did go four times a week, so that's a win. And I'm not going to be vlogging this weekend, but I am going to try my goddamn hardest to stick to it because I already had like a cheat day that I allowed myself and now I had a cheat meal that I'm kind of depressed about. So, uh, yeah. <sighs> Wish me luck for next week, guys, and for this weekend. Hope you guys are doing way better than I am. Guys. I think emotional eating is my downfall. That is where everything just, like, it sucks. <laughs> I'm laughing right now, but I already struggled through the whole week. So when you saw me on Friday struggling, 
and that kind of went on till Saturday. I kind of noticed that every time that I kind of screw it up for myself, it's not only because I'm having a cheat day, it's like, okay, I'm gonna emotionally eat my feelings away, and I do it, and apparently I just don't have the willpower to stop. So I want to change that, I want to challenge myself, and I started challenging myself this Sunday actually, and I am glad to say that this Sunday I was like completely, utterly clean in my weight loss journey, and I'm really excited because that gave me kind of like a good start to my Monday. So next week I'm basically just challenging myself each day and every day is a new step, so I don't want to just make a whole week of me trying to like accomplish things i just want to accomplish something every single day and yeah i think that by having that in mind it's going to be a lot easier for me i know i'm not going to be able to post my wednesday videos but maybe in the future once like my emotional eating is okay and i am okay i can like make more videos for you guys and who knows, maybe like one week I'll be like super great and be like, ah, I'm gonna post one, so you never know. Maybe someday you'll get a Thursday video. Anyways, love you guys so much and thank you for watching. See you next week. Mwah.